Pope Francis led prayers in front of more than a thousand Catholic faithful in the former Soviet state of Georgia on Saturday, but the country's Georgia Orthodox population was visibly absent. The Georgia Orthodox Church, worshipped by 85% of the country, issued a statement on its website forbidding followers from attending his Mass. The Pope arrived in the Georgian capital of Tbilisi Friday to much fanfare, meeting with Georgian Orthodox Patriarch Ilya II and emphasized unity between the Catholic and Orthodox churches. However, the Papal Council was informed that night that the official Georgia Orthodox delegation would not attend Mass the next day. The Church has become a strong symbol of national identity since Georgia broke from the Soviet Union and many worshippers protested the Pope's arrival, saying it was a threat to the Church. Meanwhile, Catholics, who make up less than 1% of the country's population, had hoped the Pope's visit would highlight discrimination they feel they face in a country overwhelmingly Orthodox. The Pope is also walking a fine line with Russian relations in Georgia. In a speech with President Georgi Margvarishvili Friday, Pope Francis remarked on the plight of refugees, but was careful not to specifically reference the 200,000 Georgian refugees that were displaced during a five-day war between Georgia and Russia in 2008. The Pope has a full itinerary for the remainder of his visit to Georgia and is scheduled to meet with leaders of various faiths before leaving the country on Sunday.